Hey guys, and welcome back to Turok. When we last left off, we were on the hunt for the leader of a gang of men called Wolfpack. And uh, we got shot down, orbiting the planet. And uh, turns out this planet's infested with dinosaurs. Everybody died because, you know, video games. And it's just us, Turok, and our friend Slade here, trying to link up with everybody else. That bridge is the only way across the valley. And that means we have to go through that base. Hmm. Sounds fun. Kane. Yes, we're after Kane. Find your way to the facility. That we can do. Oof. Sounds like... Yeah. Yeah, you would have thought that they would, uh, if they... If this is their planet... They would have at least some kind of defense against these raptors and dinosaurs. They would have developed some kind of tactics. Oof. Yeah, that would have been a better idea. I'll give you that. But we need to get the flare gun. Shit, let's go. Now, let's be a sneaky little creeper. And hopefully... Oof. Oh, nice. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, get him, Slade. I think we put enough bullets in that raptor's ass to keep him down for a while. There we go. Good enough. Hopefully, they're going to keep killing themselves off. Oh, hello. Didn't even see you there, buddy. I do love the uh, the sparks that come off their armor when you hit them. It's really satisfying. Yeah, get fucked, pal. Hostile confirmed. Yeah, chewing you guys to pieces. Get out of here. Yeah, they're very generic. Oh shit, grenade. Oh god. No grenade indicators, so we're, we're way before that stuff. Well, not exactly before that stuff, but I'd say before it was standard anyway. We do have regenerating health though, which is kind of interesting. Yeah, every game had that on the 360, pretty much. Thanks, Halo, for popularizing that. Alright, well, I think we're clear, more or less. Oh god, I say that, we've got a fucking dino charging around. Oh, that looks so vicious, the way we just slice his face. If we're going to have dinos, we want to. Definitely going to want two SMGs out. I'm checking out the wreckage. Two guns, twice the fun. Burn through ammo at twice the rate as well. Ah, looks like we've got a new toy here. Tech bow. This bow is for you. It represents your passage to the next level of training. Is this a joke? Far from it. It's a pity that you're so ashamed of your heritage, Tyrell. Because it so happens that some of the most feared warriors of all time were the Kiowa Indian tribe, your ancestors. And the bow was their weapon of choice. Uh, here we go. Stay low to the grass so I can't see you. That'd be a great weapon. If we were fighting General Custer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you have no idea, my friends. It is powerful and silent. It's worth its weight. Yeah, as Turok, you always get a bow. It's like the first ranged weapon we get. Can't remember like how good the range on it was. Yeah, I guess that was us. 
Now, what I do like about that, actually, if you um, slowly bring the trigger back, you can actually um, put the arrows... Oh, God damn it. God damn it. That was bad. Oops, sorry, Slade. <laughs> In my uh, jam moment there, I almost knifed Slade. I don't think you can kill him, though. All right, can we? I don't know. We're doing some experimentation here, guys. I don't know if we can knife soldiers if we get close enough to them. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we can. That's quite cool. I don't know if um, they have to be stealth kills, to be honest. So we're going to use the knife where we can to try and get that achievement to pop. Uh, really? Terrible checkpoint. I don't know why um, game developers never set their checkpoints after scenes like this. I mean, I think game developers in recent years have got slightly better with that, but not really. So at least now we have a long-range weapon because as cool as the SMG is, it is very much short-range only. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneak, 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 and die. Oh, they didn't even notice. You idiots. You notice, though. Yeah, definitely having some slight frame issues, but not too bad, I guess. Oh, shit. Really? Just how dumb are these guys? No, really. <laughs> nice. I like the fact that this knife apparently goes straight through this high-tech body armor. Oof, God, here we go. Damn it, Slade. If you could finish your targets off, that would help me. There we go. Not bad. Not bad, Slade. Alright. We will make a, a somewhat solid team yet. I think most most of our bullets went between his legs, but hey, that's fine. It was a thought that counts, you know. Onward, Slade. Let's go, buddy. I'm not your buddy, guy. You are now, Slade. The only buddy you've got, so... Tough titties. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Not good. Definitely feeling a little bit allergic to bullets here. Oof. And luckily, so are these guys. Where's the where's that fire coming from? Ah, hello friendos. Something just exploded. Oh, shit. Yeah, they're down there. That's fine. I don't think our bow's going to be that good. I mean, it's not exactly a sniper rifle after all. Eh, we can always try it, I suppose. The only problem with the bow is you can only hold it for so long before you actually uh, let it go, which is a... Oh, God. What? He actually landed that grenade up here? Jesus, talk about godlike nade throw. Where'd he go? I don't know, Slade. Pretty sure you have the same eyes and ears I do. Uh-oh. That was a hell of a grenade throw, man. Just to balance it on that log like that. Way above his pay grade. I don't think we've got any kind of... Um, oh, God. Any kind of sprint mechanic in this game. Come on, you fuckers. Oh, nice. Get fucked. Whoa, dude, come on. Yeah, you're done, son. You're done. Name's Turok. 
All right, what are we looking at? Oh, that's the guy that punted that grenade over. What a champion. Absolute champion. I guess we're not going that way. Follow the dead bodies, I guess. Ah, this looks better. Into the foliage. Oh, hey guys. Probably would have been a really good place to try and get that grenade throw, to be honest. But hey, I'm sure we'll have more opportunities for an epic nade throw. I don't even know what nade button is. I think it's like Halo, where grenades are a separate weapon that you have to select, which I've always hated. I'm pretty sure nades are uh, mapped to something. Probably not when you can dual wield. Go get him, boy! Slade, let the dino eat his face, Slade. Jesus, man. You were the one earlier that said we should let them kill each other. Ooh, look at this. Let's split up and flank them. I'll go left. You can go left, buddy. We'll go right. I'm going to show you how good this bow can be, Mr. Slade. Nope. I guess it would have been good if we could get some sort of high high ground. I guess this is the highest ground we're going to get. Uh, it's got like one of those kind of um, stealth mechanics where I guess if you alert the enemies, they instantly all become alerted, but I'm not sure, actually. Not bad, Turok, not bad. Ooh, headshot. Oh, you little fuckers. Yeah, it doesn't sound like the soundtrack's much to write home about either. Don't know if we can reclaim these arrows either. Do like the fact they've got little lights on. Die quietly, man. Right, we're good. We're good. That was a pretty smooth operation, if I say so myself. Probably the smoothest we're ever going to have. Not bad. Okay, that was fun. Uh, apparently... Apparently... My stream deck stopped working. And did not unpause the game. So... That's cool, game. That's cool. Anyway, so we're kind of basically back to where we were. Right. Let's try that again, shall we? What's with all the pipes? Hmm. Pipes indeed. Yeah, that was really frustrating. Stream Deck. Stream Deck's one of those tools that you should be able to absolutely rely on. But every now and again, it just glitches out and causes really annoying problems. Okay, let's kill these guys. Let's try and use the knife. Oh, God. Ah, fuck it. Well, that went about as well as you'd expect. Which is not very, to be honest. That's fine. Yeah, the stealth is... Well... Yeah, the stealth is not great, to be honest. Ah. Oh. Let's destroy the eggs there. Which is going to piss off some dinos. 
And we're going to get the fuck up here. And hope we can use that to our advantage. Let's get the silencer going. See the eggs? Let's give that a go. That works. There we are. Mix things up a little bit. Nice. So we've got dinos coming from both sides. Unfortunately, I don't think it's going to do a... Yeah. Not exactly going to do a brilliant job, is it? I guess... Don't want to be firing these arrows. Oh, there's another one. Okay. I was going to say... I guess we know that Space Marines... That is great stealth. What are you talking about? Okay, it would have been great stealth. If this bow would actually hit people. Like so. Uh, not really sure what the repercussions of setting the alarm off are. And is that Dino, like, sticking his head through the... Yep, he's sticking his head through the door there, which is a little bit awkward. Ah, yeah, look, here we go. Here's some grunts. That's some more arrows. Now, let's see what kind of range this bow has, shall we? It doesn't seem to have any kind of drop, which is interesting. Now, I also cannot overstate how hard it is to aim. Because being an old FPS on a console, the dead, the dead zone on the sticks is really weird. Hey, buddy. Oh, that's some bullshit right there, pal. There's no way. No way. There we go. No way you knew I was there. Calling extreme levels of bullshit. Okay, so there's no collectibles either. I think I've mentioned that before. Oh, God. Um, how do I throw grenades? Um, surely one of these buttons has to be grenade. Hey, we got it. <laughs> nice. Happy with that. Yeah, so grenade is the uh, left button, apparently. Left bumper. Now, getting 10 headshots in this game in a row, I think that's going to be a challenge. Just because of how imprecise... Oh, hello. Imprecise the game is. Now, I don't know... Yeah, when you're dual wielding, you can't use grenades. Which makes sense, you know. You wouldn't expect that you could. But grenades aren't given out like, uh, like candy. Like they are in Halo, which is unfortunate. All right, buddy. There you go. Might not have been the most stealthiest of uh, entrances, but we got there. So I'm guessing we're going through here. But also, there is another way upstairs. I think. I don't know if that is actually another way. Or is one of these doors just straight up locked? No, okay, I guess we've got options. I like options. We've got pistols. Not a fan of the pistol. It's just... Oh, right, it's just like an armory. So the pistol... I um, can't really remember. So you've got like a single fire sort of thing. And then you've got this Leon-esque rapid fire thing going on but why you'd have the pistol over the SMG I'm not sure <coughs> maybe it's more powerful it's probably more accurate to be fair but we've got the bow if we need accuracy so it doesn't really matter and the SMG is versatile as well because we can silence that puppy right 
Right, let's go, Slade. Let's go see what this place has for us. Oh, we have cut scenage. Cover more ground if we split up. Stay in radio contact. Um, okay. I mean, I guess he must trust us more than he's letting on because... He's not exactly just leaving us to die, is he? Looks like we've got some dudes in here. Let's see if we can get anyone with a knife. Oh, hey, friend. I guess, you know, maybe not. Kind of a little bit sly having that guy just around the corner. Ready to fuck you in the ass as you walk past. No matter. Hey, friend. Yeah, so notice that this game came out in 2008. And we've got better shooting mechanics and enemy AI than Devil's Third, which came out in 2015. Actually, this game looks better as well. Plays better too. Is that going to become a thing now? Am I just going to be taking the piss out of Devil's Third? Like, probably. Ah, this is the weapon that I was thinking of. Right, this is like a weird sticky gun. Look at all these weapons here. I don't know if we can actually get into those. So that fires like a sticky bowl of plasma, which you can then push the button again to... Fire again, I guess. Yeah, so you fire it once and then detonate. And then the secondary fire is. What is that secondary fire? Like a shotgun, I guess? Interesting. Well, it's a pretty rad weapon. We're going to hold on to it for now. Certainly going to come in handy. We just, like, have that, please. Thank you. All right, what have we got here? Some big equipment of some description. Probably something to do with these doors here. Ah, hey, friends. Really, dude? You just took a thousand bullets? There we go. Yeah, really satisfying gunplay. And the enemies are generally quite interesting to fight, too. Oh. Oh, come on, dude. So, that's basically how to use this weapon. It's cool. It's like the sticky grenades from Halo, except uh, you can detonate them whenever you want. Don't know. Oh, hello. Oh, it's so satisfying. Yeah, I'm not sure if we can actually sticky grenade enemies. We can. We can actually get these to stick to enemies. <laughs> That's so cool. Really? Yeah, that worked. Alright. Yeah, as fun as that is, you know, this SMG is just delicious. Oh, hey, friend. It just reminds me of a weapon that you get in some 80s action film. Just blazing away, killing everything in sight. Now, can we get some more ammo for that sticky gun? I guess not. So, it looks like we can only hold three nades at a time. Which is fine. So, I guess this is the uh, building that we've got to make, use to make it across that bridge that we were talking about earlier. Okay. We'll get lots of that pistol as well. I really. Ooh, son of a. Bitch. <laughs> okay. That was quite cool. Uh, all weapons have an alternate use. Um, really? Dude. Okay. I think some of these checkpoints are going to be a little bit on the savage side. Oh, man. That was brutal. Okay. So he's... Alright, 
Let's see if we can actually knife some guys, shall we? Let's see if it's actually possible to get some kind of a stealth thing going on here. Nope, I guess not. Not really. I think stealth was probably an afterthought to this game. But then, I guess you don't really need it, so... It is what it is. So, enemies kicking explosives at you. I'm curious to see if that was scripted or if that was just something they did. I mean, I'm guessing that that was a scripted kind of thing, but... I don't know, man. Right, let's go grab... Do I even want that sticky explosive gun? Eh, maybe, I guess. Kind of just like the SMG, to be honest. Something about this. You know, it's probably one of my favorite weapons in um, video game history, actually. Out of all video games. It's just something intrinsically fun about it. It's the way you get all the sparks fly. The way the brass flies everywhere. The way the weapon sounds and feels. It's just a solid, standard weapon. Got ya! Yes! That's how it's done, boys. That's how it's done. Have we got anybody else down here? We have. Oh, fuck. Yes! Really? Fucking really. That was bad, the way that just didn't activate. Let's get him, let's get him. Yes! I mean, okay. It's possible, I guess. That was smooth. Smooth and fun. Ah, look, there's another dude there. Can we wait for him to piss off? Don't know would be the answer to that. I think that... Oh, God. He... Yep. Yeah. Oh. Really? Took him a while to realise what was going on, didn't it? Um, can, why can't I move? Okay, I was stuck on the floor. Interesting. Watch your back. Enemies will try and flank you. Yes, they will. So, yeah, I think stealth is going to be a bit of a write-off here. To be honest, I think it's just easier to just murder through everybody. A little bit like that. At least you know where you are with murdering your way through. Now, there is a way you can go up there, but it doesn't lead anywhere. Maybe it's for a stealthier approach. We're not going to go for achievements. Just because I think we'd be here all day if we did. Especially the 100 knife kills. I mean, that's a little bit OTT, if you ask me. 100 knife kills? But then I guess that's meant to take uh, multiplayer into account. Although sometimes these enemies just straight up don't realise you're here. Which is kind of funny. Ooh. Yeah, I haven't had as much fun with two weapons since Halo 2's campaign with the dual wielded SMGs on that they're brutal but the only trouble with that is you can't hold enough ammo to really like let loose and enjoy yourself are they throwing nades at me? probably oh it's so powerful so good yeah this game definitely got a poor shout I think right let's see if they're going to kick a barrel down again this time we'll be ready for them so if we push A and left or right, we can actually like roll in that direction or at least dodge, which is interesting. Yep, that happens. Happens again. So I guess that is a scripted scene. Uh, it's still cool though. Go keep on your toes. Get fucked, pal. And you. Oof, we got more. That guy thought he was hot shit. Just left him full of holes. Ooh. Are they doing something to the center of the planet? Hmm. 
I guess we're about to find out. Or maybe not about to find out, but I guess we are going to find out one way or another. Hey, friend. More dudes coming in. I don't know if um, you get different types of enemies a little bit later on. I know there is a really delicious selection of weapons. At least I remember there is. I guess, as always, we shall find out as we go through. Ooh. I don't know, man. This planet's being terraformed. No wonder it's so screwed up. Exponential increase in evolutionary activity. Mm -hmm. Hey, Turak. Maybe you'll grow some balls while you're here. <laughs> I don't know, man. I think Slade is growing on me. <laughs> He's quite funny. He's actually fairly well acted, I think. Um, anyway, guys, I'm going to leave this part here. When we come back, we're going to contern, uh, contern, yes, contern. We're going to return to our murder thon. Till then, guys. Thanks for watching.